State 02. Carolina Panthers fans will fill Gibbs Stadium at Wofford tonight for the first practice of the annual training camp in the upstate. And there's a big party planned to get it all started. Jennifer Martin is live at the Panthers' summer home in Spartanburg with food and hopefully, hopefully a to-go bag. <laughs> I mean, if you're lucky, Fred, I can bring this back to you. Yes, so there is food all across Spartanburg. Businesses are getting in on the fun. <laughs> and uh, it's th that's because the Panthers training camp, it really gets the whole community together. And it all starts at 4 p.m. with the kickoff party here at Gibbs Stadium at Wofford College. And it's going to be fun. I mean, I'm talking Sir Purr's going to be there, the Top Cats. Uh, we've got uh, the percussion band. So it's just, it's so much fun. Kids get involved. There's face painting, their food trucks, and the best thing is all of that is free. So admissions free, parking is free. This is the 24th year that Wofford has done this. And you you mentioned the food that I'm holding in my hand here. Yes, this is a donut from one of those local businesses. We've got Elizabeth here from Downtown Deli and Donuts and tell us what we're looking at right now. Well, so this is our Panther Paw Donut, and it is actually the winner of our design, um, our Panther Donut Contest. Okay. So first time it's ever been seen. <laughs> so that's really fun. So a lot of businesses are offering specials like this. We've got the Crepe Factory. They've got a black and blue special. Um, they've also got a perfect latte. The local hiker offers 10% off if you're wearing Panthers gear. Um, let's see, what else do we have? Do you remember any others? Um, Little River Roasting is mm -hmm. doing, um, I think, 20% off their coffee drinks if you wear your Panther gear in. And um, so, I, you know, it's a great opportunity for businesses and individuals to just say, hey, we're glad you're here. Oh, yeah. You and know? it really, and it's crazy what it does to the economy. It brought in $13.5 million to the Spartanburg economy last year. That was according to a Clemson study. So mm -hmm. it's really helping. And you guys feel like there, it brings more people in, right? I think it does. I mean, I know it does. Last year was our first full year open um, during training camp, and mm -hmm. I was amazed at how many people in Panthers gear came in, said they were here for training camp, found us, came in for, you know, breakfast and lunch. That's so so fun. I've seen firsthand and the this difference. this looks delicious. I mean, cream cheese frosting, cashews for little toes. It's yep. really cute. Uh -huh. It is cute. <laughs> and uh, Karen Summer one um, suggested this donut. So it's got a mixed berry filling mm. and then the blueberry cream cheese so on top. Thanks, Elizabeth. I'm going to have to try this a little bit later. And Fred, if you're lucky, you might get some of this too. But <laughs> remember, if you want to come to the training camp, the gates open today at 4 p.m., practices at 6.30. And of course, there are lots of practices in between until the end of uh, mid-August when it ends. Back to you.